honestly never even occurred to me that I would be prevented from doing anything in my life because I'm a woman. Over and over again, people tell us, "Yeah, but people don't really want to see films about women, so maybe you should think about making something else." The movies you watch don't just affect your hobbies; they affect your career choices, your emotions, your sense of identity. Ninety-five percent of all of the films that you have ever seen were directed by men. That affects you. That affects all of us. I have two pieces of very good and important news. There are female filmmakers, but look at this trajectory. Either you have to accept that women are actually five percent as talented as men, or you have to accept that there are serious systemic issues. Good news number two: films by and about women make more money. Films that feature women actually make 23 cents more on every dollar than films that don't. So here is my four-point plan for the revolution: number one, watch movies. Watch one film by a female. Filmmaker per month. Step two: Make movies. Don't wait for permission. Make your movies now, today. Features, not shorts. There is an audience for them, and they want and need to see them. Three: Invest in each other. If we can figure out how to make our movies and deliver them to the audiences that want them, that's it. That's the whole game. Four: The old models of financing and distribution are crumbling. Please come in and disrupt it. Hollywood is leaving money on the table. Come pick it up. This is not about making one industry better. This is about making a better world.